In this week's Fresh Produce Market Overview, we discuss the latest trends and prices in the vegetable and fruit markets of South Africa, with food inflation starting to play a larger role internationally. We also saw banana prices increasing, but low demand that can negatively impact most prices over the coming week. All in this week's episode, so make sure to stay tuned. The outlook is made possible by Standard Bank, that plays a crucial role across the full agribusiness value chain, from what happens on the farm and beyond the farm gate, right up to when the farm's product reaches the retailer's shelves. Because of this, they understand the full agricultural ecosystem and the trends and risks across the sector, and they're able to give guidance on the right finance, insurance, and working capital solutions at every stage. Standard Bank, it can be. Was the Hilux born a legend? No, it was made one by you. Hi, I'm Dr. Johnny van der and welcome to this week's AMT Fresh Produce Market Overview, where we look at the latest prices and trends in the agricultural sector of South Africa. An important factor influencing our local agricultural prices is the exchange rate, and we saw the rand dollar rate that remained very stable around the 15 rand mark over the past week or so and traded on 14 rand 91 per US dollar. Energy costs are unfortunately becoming more expensive with the Brent oil price rising to $83.55 a barrel. There is again concern about rising food inflation worldwide which could possibly bring the focus back to possible higher interest rates very soon. Looking at the fruit and vegetable markets, demand is expected to decrease over the next two weeks as we are in the middle part of the month at the moment. Looking at price movements the past week, however, the potato price decreased from its record level to 87 Rand 93 per 10 kilogram bag. This was mostly due to low demand and a 39% increase in volumes the past week. As was expected, the latest tomato price increased by 16% to 10 Rand 68 per kilogram last week. We have experienced warmer weather the past week or so, which already resulted in more volumes to enter into the markets. This coupled with the extremely low demand currently on the markets can result in this price to decrease significantly over the next week or so. The current price increased by 2% to 2 Rand 54, which is 38% lower than a year ago. Low demand can put pressure on this price again this week, but it can gain some support in December again when we expect demand to increase. The latest onion price decreased by 3% to 2 Rand 55 per kilogram last week, with volumes increasing by 12% week on week. We're expecting this price to stabilize and even get some support over the next month, especially when we move towards the end of this month. Other vegetable prices traded as follows. Cabbage prices decreased to 1 rand 85, garlic prices decreased to 53 rand 89, spinach prices increased to 1 rand 97, sweet potatoes increased to 5 rand 1 cent, while the latest pepper price increased by 21% to 15 rand 70 per kilogram last week, with the yellow pepper price increasing to 30 rand 92 per kilogram last week. This was mostly due to very limited availability. This section was brought to you by Nile Marketplace. Nile provides an online platform that enables you to sell your fresh produce directly to retailers, processors and packers. The platform provides maximum price transparency, which means you know the exact price that your produce is sold at before it leaves the farm. Payments are secured on your behalf and dispersed within 24 hours. Fresh produce trading has never been this efficient. Learn more at Nile.ag. Looking at the latest fruit prices, the banana price increased by 8% to 8 rand 8 cents, with volume sold decreasing week on week. Low demand this week can however limit any upward movement over the coming week or so. The average apple price increased by 2% to 7 rand 68, with the gala price still decreasing due to higher volumes the past week. However, sundowner prices increased, which supported the higher average prices. The latest pear price increased to 8 rand 9 cents per kilogram last week and continued to increase due to seasonality. 
In the citrus market, the latest orange price traded on 2 Rand 94 per kilogram. Orange prices can gain significant momentum from year on out as volumes will become more scarce until the end of the year and early in next year. The latest lemon price traded 1% higher on 4 Rand 41 per kilogram. The avocado price increased by 4% to 24 Rand 57 per kilogram. As mentioned last week, we are expecting these prices to stay in an upward trend until the end of January due to lower volumes. The table grape price traded on 58 Rand 32 per kilogram with a significant increase in volumes that is expected in December to put a downward pressure on this price then. The latest pineapple price increased by 11% to 7 Rand 71 per kilogram, we have blueberry prices trading 8% lower on 36 Rand 83 per kilogram the past week. The blueberry price is currently 34% lower than last year, with volumes on the markets currently 72% higher than a year ago. Make sure to contact Halfway Toyota for the best price and service in the country for the Toyota of your choice. This broadcast was made possible by Standard Bank, Now Marketplace and Halfway Toyota. I'm Johnny van der Merwe and thank you for watching.